Hello students, welcome to Chori Math. Let's work this question by working what is in the root first. Now, looking at the screen, by careful observation, you find out that there's a relationship between these two. There's a relationship between these two and there's a relationship between these two. Now, what do I mean? Check it out. You see, this, the first set can be written as 1 over 5, then plus 1 over 5 times 9. All right? The second one, can be written as 1 over um, 13 times 9, then plus 1 over 13 times 17. So we have this. Then the last one, the last set, will, can be written as 1 over 21 times 17, then plus 1 over 21 times 25. Okay, that is exactly what I meant earlier on. Now, having this set, you can factorize. And what do I mean? Check it here. We have 5 at the denominator here. We have 5 at the denominator. So, we can bring out 1 over 5. Then, it's going to be into 1 plus 1 over 9. The same thing we are going to do to the second set. Why? Because we have 13 here, 13 here at the denominator. So, we are going to bring 1 over 13 out so that we can have 1 over 9 uh, plus 1 over, please take note, this is 17, okay? 1 over 17. You close the bracket. Then, plus, if you check very well, you can see that here we have 21 and we have 21 here. So, we can bring out 1 over 21. Then into 1 over 17, then plus 1 over 25, okay? So we are making good progress. Now, see what we are going to do. This is 1 over 5. I'm going to work the bracket, but I'll avoid the usage of calculator by saying the LCM here is 9. So that I have 9 plus 1. I close the bracket. Then plus 1 over 13. Then the LCM here is 9 times 17. So I'm going to have 17 plus 9. I close the bracket, then plus, I have 1 over 21, then into the LCM is 17 times 25. Okay, so that I'm going to have 25, then plus 17. Remember, I told you that I'm avoiding the use of calculator. Now, this is 1 over 5, then it's going to be into 10 over 9, okay? Then plus 1 over 13 into 26 over 9 times 17. Close the bracket, plus 1 over 21 into, we have um, uh, 42, okay? All over 17 times 25, all right? Now we can see that uh, 5 year 1 and 5 year 2, then five, uh, 13 year 1, 13 year 2, 21 year 1, 21 year 2. Now having this, everything now boils down to be equals to 2 over 9 plus 2 over 9 times 17 plus uh, 2 over 17 times 25. Now factorizing 2 out. Uh, this is what I'm going to have, 2 into 1 over 9, uh, then plus 1 over 9 times 17, then plus 1 over 17 times 25, okay? Now, watching closely, we can now see that there is something else that we can do here. And what is it? Now, look at here, I have 9. Or if I don't want to make use of that, I will just see here I have 17, here I have 17, okay? So that I'm going to have 2 into 1 over 9. Then I have plus. What I'm going to bring out here is 1 over 17. So that I'm going to have 1 over 9 plus uh, 1 over 25. Okay. Now, having this... This is going to be 2 into 1 over 9. 
Then I have plus 1 over 17. Uh, of course, into the LCM is 9 times 25. Okay. So that I'm going to have, uh, this is going to be 25 plus 9. Okay. So this is 2 into 1 over 9 plus 1 over 17. Then into we have 34 all over 9 times 25. Okay. Close the bracket and we can now see that 17 year 1, 17 year we have 2. So going further, I have 2 into 1 over 9. Then plus I'm going to have 2 over 9 times 25. Okay. Now we've come again because here is 9 and here is 9. So I can factorize 1 over 9 so that I'm going to have 2 over 9 outside. Then into 1 plus uh, 1, sorry, not 1 again, plus 2 all over 25. Now, doing this, I'm going to have 2 over 9. Then into the LCM is 25. So I'm going to have 25 plus 2. I close the bracket. Now, this is 2 over 9 into, I have 27 over 25. Close the bracket. 2 year 1, 2 year 3. So, everything boils down to 6 over 25. But this is not the final answer. All right? So, because it is not the final answer, the final answer is we are going to find the root. Okay? So, it's going to be the root of 6 over 25 which will be root of 6 over 5. So this is the final answer. So thank you for watching and make sure you subscribe for more interesting videos.